frighten me right here, I don't give a The Green Berets is a US propaganda film directed by and starring John Wayne. And this film is horrible. This film is a blatant piece of American propaganda. The film's main plot is about John Wayne as he leads the good fight against the evil commies. While the skeptics of a war are proven wrong, as this is a supposedly noble war to stop the evil commies. Which is bullcrap. The Green Beret's message is basically America good, commies bad. And it's such a cliched propaganda filled message. The film literally begins with an upbeat song basically saying let's kill some commies. So basically, according to this film, killing someone, taking another person's life is a lot of fun and a patriotic duty to your nation. Which is honestly full of crap. Telling someone is never fun, it's never a feat. For anyone who is not a sociopath, it is the most scarring thing a person can do, and for many, they never get over the trauma of taking one's life. So, this film basically saying that it is full of fun to fight a war and kill the enemy as it's a patriotic duty is a fight insulting and not true. But the dialogue to this film is also quite horrendous. The film has some vomit inducing horrible lines that are just hilarious at points to listen to. It is horribly written and this film is from a technical standpoint is also terrible. The film is so lazily shot that it appears at times that they aren't even trying. There are shots in this film that look horrible. It is as if the director decided, okay, so the character will be walking here. We must get them in the camera. Doesn't matter how it looks, as long as they are in the picture. It's like a home movie amateur-like filmmaking. And the editing does not save this film in any way. The editing is nowhere near the standards of filmmaking. It's as if a 12-year-old edited the film. The sets to this film aren't good either, with it appearing that the film didn't even attempt to make the area look like Vietnam, with the film having glaringly obvious pine trees accompanying it. Vietnam is a tropical moist place with tropical rainforests. The environment for pine trees to grow does not exist in Vietnam. The fact that the film didn't even do their homework into the geography of the, the way in which Vietnam looks clearly reveals how sloppily done this film is. The film's acting isn't even that good. I could pass John Wayne as he does play the tough ma macho man patriotic colonel, but the guy was 60 at around the time this film was made and his age clearly shows as he is accompanied by far younger, fitter men, while this old man attempting to do all these things uh, is quite well, hilarious to look at, as it is a bit laughable when, in the way he runs. The Vietnamese in this film, well, I won't even call them Vietnamese, as they clearly aren't. In an attempt to make the Asian actors sound Viet Vietnamese, they all did a Japanese accent? I swear that's what the annoying kid sounded like, a badly impersonated Japanese accent that was really grinding and annoying to listen to. And the Vietnamese don't even sound Japanese. The Green Berets, however, is not all bad. I guess the props to this film were good, mainly because the film was funded by the US government. That they were supplied with actual equipment. This is most obvious when they arrive in Vietnam. The might of the US Army is out to show off how mighty and impressive the US are with its full military might. Ignoring the fact that some of the equipment doesn't actually belong there. That being said, one good thing does not make up for a lot of bad things. The Green Berets is horrible propaganda and it receives a um, D minus. Thanks guys, and if you enjoyed this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more.